Last year was rough. I, I can't lie, and I think I can speak for everyone when I say that. Nobody wants to be a part of a team that goes one in 20 something. You know? Coach is doing what he knows what can't happen, what happened last year. So uh, he's changing a lot of things. After a season littered with losses, game cancellations, and empty arenas, COVID-19 brought with it a year Vandals basketball won't soon forget. You learn to be very flexible each and every day. You could wake up and have a plan as to what was gonna happen that afternoon, and after a COVID test, after complications from that were completely out of your hands, your day was jumbled up and you had to figure it out. It just lights a fire for you that, for us this year and it makes us see what we don't want to do and it gives us a lot of things to improve on. Inside the wooden fortress of ICCU Arena, there's a feeling of a fresh start as the Vandals return to the hardwood and the fans return to the bleachers. I'm very excited that we finally get back to what college basketball is supposed to be all about. Uh, the student body and they're the band and here are fans getting ready to watch. I'm looking forward to, and probably just like every other college player in the nation, just some normalcy, getting back to where we're playing at arenas packed and having a home court advantage and the energy that fans bring in. Idaho returns a young core, along with nine transfers, adding some much needed depth. It was imperative that we add some older guys, which we did in the spring. We're very excited about the group that we added, and to your point, guys that have had success along the way, whether it was in their high school days, if they came from a four-year school, if they came from a junior college, guys that have experienced winning. Experience like Rashad Smith and Mikey Dixon, two transfers from Grand Canyon University who helped lead their program to March Madness last season, both of whom looking to bring that winning spirit to the town of Moscow. Nobody wants to have a season like, like last year. and I think we're all improving, getting in the gym, like extra hours, um, just doing what we can to make sure that we're ready for the first game. And the expectations are clear for the men in black and gold. Return this program to its winning ways. I think really just the only thing is to win. I know we, we have a lot of guys that are very unselfish and, and we all have a similar mindset in that what happened last year is not going to happen again and we're gonna do whatever it takes to, to get some W's up.